Hi everyone. So thanks for joining us on day two at the Global Garden Journey. Today we are at Warra Farms. Today, Alison and I are hanging out. He's going to be giving us a bit of a 101. We are talking all things biodiversity. Green Eco Beauty Day. Biodynamic farming. Stay tuned. And of course, like with all the beautiful Valeda products as well, nothing that we use today has any um, petrochemicals in it, no synthetic fragrance in it, um, no paraben preservatives in it, no synthetic anything. No really. nasty. Just no nasty. And so I think if, if we had more farms, if we had more access to this produce, if the supermarkets didn't have a massive hold on price and the cost and, and the way that it's all moved about, then I think we could see a massive shift in, in our, just our sense of being, our sense of wellness. Once, even just once a day, to refuse or reduce or reuse, then we can make such a difference and that will just make a huge global impact and who doesn't want to protect the ocean? But I think the important thing to remember is us as humans, we're not separate from the environment, we are part of the environment and ocean health directly relates to human health. I think people need to be much more mindful about Diversity, you know, we've got diversity of people, diversity of everything. And these days there is such a loss of uh, pollinators and biodiversity in the world that if you can find a way of doing something about it, you can make a real difference. 50% of the food we eat comes because something is pollinated, whether it's bee, a wasp, or uh, another type of insect or whatever else. And the more we knock down uh, trees and the more land clearing we do and the more pesticides we put on the soil reduces their ability to be there.